So I'm on vacation this week with the family and a few of the days we get to spend by the pool and I get to meet people from all around and that common question comes up of what do you do? Now, a few years ago, I remember wanting to have this really interesting reply or answer for people for the small chance that they might become a client. And I used to look at everybody as a potential client. I don't know if you've ever felt this way too. So I struggled with, do I need a catchy elevator pitch or do I just say that I'm a financial advisor? But now my answer is actually quite boring because we don't have an interest in getting new clients because we're getting about 50 people a month that's reaching out for an intro call thanks to the content that we're posting on LinkedIn and YouTube. But I'll share what we would say if I didn't have that lead engine. And by the way, if I haven't met you yet, I'm Dave Zoller. I own Streamline Financial with Tim and we created this channel to help advisors like you by sharing what's worked to get to this point and how we're continuing to grow our firm. So if you're an advisor, subscribe because this is one of the only channels out there that's sharing actual tips from practicing advisors. So the answer I give now is quite boring, but I'll share what I used to say when I was interested in attracting new clients. So now I say, when when somebody asks, so what do you do? I just say, I own a wealth management firm or I own an investment firm. And they may ask questions about it or they may, maybe they won't, but if it's someone over 50, I might give a different answer and I'll say, I own a retirement planning firm. And sometimes they might say, oh, I need to talk to someone like you, but most of the time they don't. I'm mainly just interested in them and curious about what they do. But what I used to say when I was more interested in talking to potential clients was, well, actually one thing I never said was I'm a financial advisor, unless I wanted to end the conversation pretty quickly. But the actual thing that I would say is usually start by saying I help. Like I help people with their finances or I help people with their retirement plans. And if they'd ask a question about that, then I'd say something like, well, you know how, and then describe a common pain that my clients have, and then say, well, I, and then provide the solution. So it could be like, you know how some people get close to retirement and then they have to switch from saving to spending money. Well, we help people make sure that they don't run out of money or something like that. Now, you could customize it to fit whatever works for you. But now that I think about it, you know, the answer we give, it really isn't that important at all. I don't think that I actually ever turned someone from a stranger into a client. Have you ever done that? Have you ever turned a, a stranger into a client? If you have, I'd love to hear about it in the comments below. But the thing that actually did work wasn't coming up with catchy things of, you know, what to say to people when when I first met them. It was really figuring out content marketing and then just getting in videos. That's the one thing that has worked the best. And it wasn't meeting people at random in the wild and hoping that they became clients. So I wouldn't actually say that having something catchy or special is that important. I would stick to something simple and focus on different marketing activities that actually do work. So if you need help finding the right marketing activities that can work for you, subscribe to this channel because I've tested a lot of them and I will continue to test a lot of them and then share the results with you. So if you're a financial advisor and you're interested in that, subscribe and then I'll see you in the next video.